Deputy Interior Minister Huan Jingqun sparked controversy yesterday when he said his agency wants to require so-called health checks of 3.84 million homes 30 years or older in Taiwan. The comments earned his boss a tough reception from lawmakers today, and real estate brokers are worried the proposal would only make a bad market worse. Interior Minister Ye Junrong tried to play down the idea of compulsory health checks for old buildings earlier proposed by his deputy Hua Jingchun without any supporting measures, instead stressing, what I say goes. But lawmakers were not impressed. All of your housing policies, including proposed revisions to the Housing Act, are well-intentioned and aimed at making people safer. But when this kind of thing comes out, it's like a rat dropping spoiling a pot of kanji. Yes, said the idea of building inspections was only being deliberated at the moment. The cabinet offered its own explanation. This policy is not yet ready and has not been submitted for consideration to the cabinet. While officials were engaged in damage control, real estate brokers worried that if the Interior Ministry requires a safety inspection report every time an old home is sold, it will hurt the market for older houses. The people don't understand that once this policy is announced, it will make the already sluggish real estate market even worse. But one expert on housing policy supported the idea. Should I really not be concerned about personal and property safety just because it's not the right time or the market is down? Earthquakes don't discriminate, so I think you need to carefully consider this and not mix up the priorities. Facing mixed reaction to the proposal, Hua Jingchun said today he humbly accepted all opinions, but still insisted that the plan was on the right path and that supporting measures would be drafted.